welcome back and uh, this may actually become a video of its own even though it's a chapter and a larger part of repairing a failed core so just in case that happens we're in Pensacola Pensacola Florida I was 30 degrees last night and um, we are repairing a failed core on a very nice boat actually and uh, I have mentioned 50 times, but we're launching into the chapter where I get really mad. Uh, this is the part where I explain to you, never, never drill a thousand stupid holes in the deck, squirting epoxy in, I don't care, magazines, boat yards, Bozo the Clown, I don't care who tells you, do not. Do not, and in case I forgot to mention it, do not drill a thousand holes in the damn deck thinking that you can squirt epoxy in and fix the deck. It's not true! It's not true. And in case I forgot to mention it, it's not true! So, now you get to see why. This is where some poor sap who believed the magazines and the rest of these boneheads drilled a thousand holes in the damn deck. And please kindly note, there's these awesome pillars of worthless epoxy that traveled nowhere, fixed nothing, achieved no product known to man, except that now there's a thousand holes in the damn deck, which you can now see from the underside. They go into wet epoxy, see the Hopefully the camera picks it up. Oh yeah, we're about to get a drip there on that one. So it goes into epoxy, goes into wet core, which is all subterranean. You can't see any of this. And you have this wonderful, there you go, you get this wonderful, nasty, wet core. The epoxy goes in there. It doesn't really stick to a damn thing. It doesn't fix anything. It doesn't get any of the moisture out. It doesn't resolve anything. But now you have these awesome pillars. Oop, lost it. These awesome pillars of epoxy. So your deck has still failed. Your core is still crap. It's still full of water. Uh, nothing has changed except there's now an extra thousand holes for water to get in. And there's these awesome pillars. So now you have this pillar, and the deck is right here at the edge of the pillar. The deck has failed, so it's going to squish. Oh yeah, it's going to squish. So when it squishes, it opens up a whole new place for water to get in. So instead of fixing anything, it actually creates a thousand new holes for water to get in and make the problem worse. And it makes it harder to pull the damn deck up when you go to fix it the right way. And the guys like me that have to come in and fix it get really pissed off at you! <laughs> so, in case I forgot to mention it, do not drill a thousand holes in the deck because it fixes nothing. And uh, it never fixes anything. So, that is the uh, brief little chapter uh, where you can actually get to see why. You can see our little pillars of epoxy that have done nothing. And you can see that they didn't, I mean, there's a couple, like here, it spread a little tiny bit, but it still did nothing. It's still this goofy stuff all around. It fixed nothing. So please, no matter what anyone tells you, in case I forgot to mention, do not drill a thousand holes in the deck. And uh, you can watch the rest of uh, this chapter or the rest of this video, or if this becomes its own video, which I think it will, uh, then you can switch back to sailboat care and repair and how you just chop the damn deck off, scoop the bad core out, drop in some fresh core, glass the thing down. It's really not as hard as people tell you that it is. And then it really actually is fixed. Truly, truly, truly fixed. Uh, the biggest problem that you have to have is a place that you can do it because there's going to be a bunch of fiberglass dust. Uh, but the work itself, it's work. And you shouldn't have a boat if you don't uh, mind doing some work. Uh, or at least don't buy a boat that has core failure if you don't mind doing some work. Because paying somebody to do this is unwise. So anyway, 
that's the gig. We'll be ending off our little chapter here. For those of you that are on the big how to fix the core, uh, we'll be back to you in a fraction of a second. And for those of you that are only seeing this, in case I forgot to mention it, do not, <laughs> do not drill a thousand holes in your damn deck. And uh, enjoy your boat. Talk to you later.